Good morning. For many, this is an incredibly sad day. Queen Elizabeth II passed away yesterday afternoon. Her death ends the 70 years she has been Queen. We mark today a remarkable life lived in service of her people. The Queen was a teenager during the Second World War. She became Queen at the age of 25 in a world where most houses didn't have televisions or even toilets inside. Queen Elizabeth dedicated her long life to serving the people of Great Britain and the Commonwealth. Some of your own relatives may have stories from when they met the Queen or saw her in person. Most people hope to retire when they're maybe 60, 65 years old. The Queen was still working and fulfilling her role last Tuesday, aged 96. While most of you will not have ever seen the Queen in person, don't be surprised if you maybe feel a little sad, or if some of your relatives feel sad at the death of the Queen. For all of us in our YJB community, Queen Elizabeth II is the only Queen we will have ever known of and been aware of throughout our lives. She lived to know 15 UK Prime Ministers and 14 American Presidents. She has been the constant in all of our lives through the changes and challenges the world has seen for 70 years. We now have a new king. King Charles III became king at the moment of the Queen's death. So even the national anthem of God Save the Queen is now God Save the King from today onward. There'll be much talk of the Queen and of her death in the coming days. It might remind you of a death of someone you knew or a relative, and it might make you feel a bit sad. That's OK. Let your form tutor or one of the wellbeing staff know if this is the case and we can support you. Today, we've made it through our first full week of term in YJB at this academic year. Since Monday, we've already had a new prime minister and today we have a new king. As a community and as a country, we will take some time to get used to these changes. But this morning, we pause and we reflect on a life well lived, dedicated to the people. May Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II rest in peace. Thank you.